This is an art attack. This is an art attack. This is art attack. <laughs> Hello there. Good to see you again. Hey, what do you think of stuff? Well, look at that. Looks brilliant. Hanging on walls, or just simply <laughs> hanging around. <laughs> and they're very easy to make. Come and have a look at this. Take a double page spread from a big newspaper and just draw your sculpture design onto it. Now you can do the lion. Put the mane like that and just do the basic design of the lion. Don't need too much detail in. Do his face in there. Just make it the lion. Bold. And funny. Very cartoon like. See that? I'll just finish it off there like that. And there he is, a lion. And when you're happy with your lion, put it out so that you have something that looks like the lion and you can add some more detail onto it at this stage if you want. Then draw around this onto another sheet of newspaper and cut that out so you have two lion shaped pieces and then just put one on top of the other like that so that they line up neatly. Then take hey, 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 hey. a stapler and be careful with your fingers on this very carefully staple the lion together like that all the way around the edges. Now you need to do this quite carefully. I'm just doing it really quickly to show you here. All the way around, about two thirds away around the edges like this. And don't forget to mind your fingers and when you've gone about two thirds of the way around, remember to stop. Like that. And when you've done that, it's time to <laughs> stuff, 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 stuff. your sculpture. Now for this you need to lightly scrunch up bits of newspaper and stuff them inside the lion like that through the opening that you've left. I'll do another one there to show you. See that? And it's a good idea to just poke some of these bits down with a ruler into the awkward areas if you need to. And remember, try not to be too rough or you'll tear the stapled edges. Keep going and when your sculpture is padded enough, it should be a bit like the lion. And don't forget to staple up a gap so that it's stapled all the way around. Now that your sculpture is fully stuffed out, it's ready to paint. And it's best to use acrylic paint or well, you could use poster paint for this, mixed with a little bit of PVA, so that the paint won't crack. I'm going to start with a nice, bright yellow. There we go. Just slopping it on as a base colour. How about a nice rich brown for the mane?
and a nice bright pink for inside the mouth there. And when you finish painting it all, you can add in some detail with black pen. And there it is, the lion. Good, isn't it? And you know, you can do all sorts of designs. How about the lion? Or how about this? You can even lie down on a big sheet of newspaper, get someone to draw around you, and then stuff it. <laughs> What do you mean he's better looking than me? <laughs> and you know, you can even make some Halloween decorations like this lion. Try it yourself. Stuffed sculptures. Keep smiling.